Hey, how you doing? It's Clayton here from HowToDrawComics.net and welcome to today's tutorial. In this video, what I'm going to show you is how to add glow effects to explosions to make them look illuminated and to just generally add some additional visual interest to them. So we're going to focus in on this particular fireball or explosion right here and it is going to serve as our main example throughout this tutorial. I'm going to create a new layer underneath the line art but above everything else and I'm going to call this we can call this shading. We'll call it explosion shading so that it has some context. We're going to change the blending mode of this layer to multiply then we are going to select a nice dark orangey red color something like that will suffice and then you can see that I have this explosion selected I've done that by going back down to the base colors layer the flats and making a selection around that area using the magic wand tool I'm going to hide that selection, hitting Control H on my keyboard, and then I'm just going to use my airbrush and gently stroke in over the top of this explosion, adding in some shading. And you can already see that now it has some dimension, just a little bit of dimension, that's all we need for now. And then we will create a new layer above that. We'll call this Explosion Highlights. And then we'll go ahead and choose our highlight color. This is going to be a lighter yellow. And then I'll simply, sh well, actually, hang on a second. Before we do that, we are going to change its blending mode to overlay. Then we are simply going to stroke very gently over the top and bring in some highlights. And already you can see that there's a, a bit of a glow almost starting to form here. So now what we can do is start actually breaking this shape up a little bit. Okay. And we can go ahead here and start to cut out selections using the magic wand tool. Uh, not the magic wand tool rather, but the lasso tool. And these are going to be lighter areas that we are going to be pulling out of the general form that this explosion consists of. Okay, great. So then once we've made those selections, we can simply, on the overlay layer, click once again to add in those additional highlights. Now finally, in order to make this explosion really look like it's glowing, we are going to create a new layer, and we are going to call this Explosion Illumination. And we are going to change that to a pin light, or is it a linear light? Let's try the linear light first. And we are going to pull it above the line art. That's where we want this layer. We want it sitting above the line art. Okay, so we've got our linear light selected in the blending mode. Now we're just going to gently tap in over the top of this explosion. And we're going to make it look as though it's actually glowing. Like so. You can lower the brightness of the color, make it more of an orange. If you'd like to enrich the hues a little bit. Because even the shadows on an explosion are somewhat illuminated. But you can see that this looks a little bit more convincing as an explosion. Now it's not flat. Look at this one over here in comparison, right? 
Okay, cool. So finally, uh, the last and final thing uh, that we can do if we really, really want to push what we've, what we've got here to a whole new level of dimension is we can make another set of selections using the lasso and this is going to be like the brightest highlights that we're going to see throughout this explosion these would be the most illuminated portions of the form okay so you can see I've made those selections there. We'll make a brand new layer above that. We'll change it to overlay. And we can call this explosion illumination two. And then we are just going to go pure white for this one. It's on overlay. And then we can gently tap over the top. Ever so slightly. There we go. And there we have it. Done. You can see that it looks just so much more rich and lush as an explosion. So I hope that helped you out. Thanks so much for watching. Till next time, keep on creating, keep on drawing, and I'll see you in the next video.